Yes, I got my chicken, you guys. All right, I'm gonna go see the Safe Haven Five. I'll do our first drawing, okay? So make sure you don't go anywhere. Have me on in the background, dishes, putting away laundry, like just doing a puzzle. I don't know. <laughs> People do puzzles. All right, so Norwex, kind of a funny name, right? So Norwex stands for Norwegian Experience, okay? So this is a global company that this really awesome guy, Bjorn, <laughs> I always say his name wrong. He came up with the EnviroCloth because he was trying to figure out how to get bugs off of windshields. Yes, that is how Norwex was created, so it's pretty cool. And then Debbie Bolton, um, she kind of took off with it and started showing people, and then Norwex just grew into this global, wonderful company. Um, very family-oriented. They're just, they're so great. So EnviroCloth, and window cloth. These were the starting factors here. We have the E for everything cloth, okay? If you have been with Norwex, you have an Enviro cloth, tell me what your favorite thing is to clean with your Enviro cloth besides the normal. So an Enviro cloth, of course, is great for counters and um, you know your kitchen table and all of that, but what is something random that it works so, so well in? Um, your kid or you, right, us, as people as human beings spill right so let's say a whole glass of milk just my kids are like go get the Norwex get the Norwex cloth it absorbs seven times its weight in water and just pick it up so these two work together will replace oh yeah Mary that's a good one walls dog prints and I know dog prints and dog um, drool and all that is like a whole other area um, and it really is hard to get off and everyone loves loves their cloths for that so with the Enviro cloth um, so think of the the other microfiber in the store right the stuff the ones that like stick on your hand I can't see I can't even I can't even talk about it it just gives me the creeps all right so that is a very cheap microfiber it's like five for five bucks at Walmart right so what is happening is that microfiber is one six of a human hair. Hey, Kristen, welcome. And the Norwex microfiber is one two hundredth of a human hair. Okay. So take a piece of hair out of your head, chop it lengthwise. Okay. 200 times. And that is how dense those fibers are. You're like, okay, well, Stephanie, what, what does that mean? Like, why do I care about that? <laughs> what does that mean for me? Right? Believe me. So what that means for you is What's happening is the those teeny tiny fibers are going across the surface like a little little finger vacuums there and it's picking up dirt grime even bacteria that's what I'm going to show you with my chicken and so that is the biggest difference between really really good high quality microfiber the cloths have a two year warranty okay and they'll last you about seven years I've had mine for about seven years so um so yes, so wet them, thank you. I used to manually wet my Enviro cloth, but it just like took up too much time. So the cloth is wet with only water. That's the beauty of Norwex, is that most of, most of the cloths you need only water to clean because it's all about the microfiber cleaning and not, you know, chemical cleaners and all that kind of stuff, right? So. There are 87,000 household chemical cleaners out there, 87,000. So guess how many have been um, kind of looked at by the FDA out of 87,000? 200. 200. So you're, you're thinking you're going to the grocery store, right? And you're like, oh, Windex. Oh, gosh. Got to get my Lysol wipes, right? And oh, okay. Oh, yeah. I got to clean. Look at that cute little guy. Look at him. He's so, he would never hurt me, right? <laughs> so what is happening is that these companies are putting whatever they want into these products. And you got Windex here, you know, fun, you know, family oriented commercials, all that. So if you spray something like Windex within 26 seconds, all those chemicals and toxins will hit every organ of your body, all right, through your nose, your mouth, and your skin, which is your biggest organ, okay? So that's why bath and beauty and all that is very important because your skin is your biggest organ as well. So it's just like, and I was like, my kids clean with this, right? So I got smart before Norwex, and I started using like all natural cleaners, seventh generation and all that. But that was getting pricey and I'm a frugal girl and you know budget and all that I'm like 
All right, so the safety of my family and, uh, you know, not spending all this money, right? So it was really hard for me. Um, and my aunt invited me to my first Norwex party, and I was like, what, a cleaning party? Are you kidding me? Like, I'm a mom going to a cleaning party. My life is at a new low, <laughs> right? So, um, but that's when I fell in love with the Enviro cloth and the window cloth, and I got an optic scarf and a bathroom scrub mitt, and that's where I started, and I kind of just went from there. Um, when I hosted my party, I got like the, the more the hidden gems kind of stuff, like outside of the safe haven five that we'll talk about, and that's when I just fell in love with it because I was saving so much time and money, um, and of course my house. So it was my health. So it was just it was life changing. It really, really was. So let's show the Enviro cloth, right? I've talked about it enough, right? <laughs> so we talked about why it cleans so well. So let me show you that. All right, so I got my mirror here. This is where I need my, like, an assistant, right? Cam, this is why I need you to come over. You can get my butter for me <laughs> out of the fridge. <laughs> Put my butter in the fridge. All right, so we're going to show you how this cleans so well. So we have our Enviro cloth, which is wet with only water, and we have our window cloth, okay? So these two work together like peanut butter jelly, Bert and Ernie, like these two belong together. I'll show you why. So I don't know if you have butter in your, uh, on your windows and whatnot at your home. If you have small children, maybe you do. <laughs> but I like with, with these kind of demos, I like to use the most extreme kind of stuff. So butter is very thick. It's very greasy, right? There we go. Oh, yeah, baby. There we go. All right. Oh, so first, let's use good old Norwex or Norwex Windex. <laughs> they both have the EX at the end. Wow, I've never made that mistake before. All right, so I'm going to spray on here. All right, so obviously this is going to be a hot mess, right? Even if I'm really spraying, I mean, eventually I'm going to get this clean, but it's going to take me a while. It's going to be very smeary. Um, and what is happening here? as well is that with anything even with a natural cleaner you are leaving a product residue on the surface right even if it's your floors or your coffee table so because there's a product residue left behind um it's always going to attract more dirt dust with windows there's always going to be streaking right because you're leaving a product residue behind so with norwax since you're using water only you do not leave a product behind and that's why you're not gonna get any streaking. And that's why you, your windows, you're not even gonna bleed. Your windows and your mirrors and your your hubbies or boyfriends or partners or whatever, they'll be like, oh, what is this? What did you get? And it's like, go clean the windows or go clean your car windows and you will see how amazing this is. <laughs> that's what I used to do at home parties with the husbands. They were like, okay, fine, that looks really good. <laughs> so the best way to use your cloth is to use it flat that is the best way to just kind of get everything up the best. It took me like a minute to get used to that. And then you kind of have eight cleaning slides, um, you know, if you're working with something with butter, right? All right, so you can see that, yes? All right, so here I go, taking off that butter. Okay, and it's gone, boom, super easy, right? Now that's where our window cloth comes in. So it's a little silkier, and then the surface is wet, right? Because I just used it in fire cloth. So then you use your window cloth and make it nice and shiny. So the Enviro cloth does the work, the dirty work, right? And then the window cloth comes in and shines it up and makes it look all pretty. Um, you could call them the boyfriend girlfriend cloth, which is like a little sexist, but um, <laughs> it works. So boyfriend cloth does all the hard, dirty work, right? And then the girlfriend cloth comes in and makes everything look all nice and shiny, right? So that's always a good way for people to remember. All right, you see my nice, make sure I didn't miss a spot, this angle I'm in. So nice, nice, clear uh, window. I miss home parties where I like would do someone's sliding glass door and everyone's like, oh my gosh. Like, <laughs> it really has that effect. But if you ordered a sample or you have, haven't ordered a sample yet, message Brianne. Um, because the samples are where it's at. That's why I send out samples. Cause I'm like, you have to see how awesome these, uh, two cloths work. And I believe in them so much. I just, I want to get them out there. It's really great. Yes. No streaks, right? I know it's so, so great. All right. So it cleans great. Okay. We need more than that, right? 
It removes bacteria, yes. All Norex microfiber removes 99% of bacteria from a surface when used properly. So you're like, okay, how is that possible, right? Well, again, it's those teeny tiny fibers that I talked about. They are so dense that they go along a surface and they are picking up everything, even bacteria. They're picking up protein, which is the smallest cell in bacteria even. So I'm gonna show you, got my raw chicken. Never in my life did I think I'd be working with raw chicken. <laughs> and I've been doing it for four and a half years now. All right, so we're gonna put it on the plate. Oh yeah, look at that. Nice, and yeah, I'm just gonna put that back in the bag, okay? See, see Andrea, I didn't even touch it. <laughs> I think you can do it. All right, so here's my protein tester here. And what we have is green is clean. Okay, no bacteria. Then there's like a gray area. Then there's purple. Purple is like full-blown bacteria, right? So, and we're working with raw chicken. So we're probably going to have, you know, some bacteria on here. Probably a, a mess of bacteria, right? <laughs> All right, so we're going to put this in. We're going to crack this. And these protein um uh, testers are not from Norwax. They're from a um, company that uses them for um, the health department to test for protein in um, restaurants and whatnot. All right, so what color is that? Yeah, it's purple because that's full-blown bacteria on there. Okay, so we got that one. I'm going to throw it off to the side. All right, so I'll put my chicken back on. And so what's happening here with this cloth? What I'm going to do, okay, I've got my chicken on. You guys see that? So this is a mechanical clean and not a chemical clean, okay? Chemical clean, it's going to leave chemicals. Um, so these are interesting. I know these are very popular nowadays. I was talking about these even before this whole craziness started. Ever be the directions on the back? No. First off, this is um, getting very close to being a pesticide, yes. And read the directions on the back. They're not even working the way you think they should be working. A lot to disinfect allow the surface to remain wet for four minutes four minutes not four seconds okay now I know teachers healthcare professionals you have to use these and I know you're using them correctly most of us consumers are not we're not using them correct so you're basically wasting your money at the same time okay so with Norwex and Norwex can't make claims about viruses or whatnot but with Norwex you can be assured it is removing bacteria that has been tested and true um, for a very very long time so I'm gonna show you that right here this is why I do chicken for you guys <laughs> so this is a mechanical clean so it's removing okay it's removing the germs it's removing the bacteria all right so I'm not doing anything fancy all right so now I have my second protein tester here take that out okay what's gonna happen oh I'm nervous no I'm not but it's really fun. It's suspenseful, right? Okay, you can see I'm really doing it, right? I'm getting all the corners. All right. So remember, green is clean. There's gray and purple. All right. What do you think, you guys? It removed all that bacteria off the plate with that chicken. Yes. So now to prove that I do, I do chicken to do chicken. <laughs> to prove that I trust the Norwex. I will lick the plate. You ready? Look away if you need to. Okay, here we go. Ew. <laughs> right? So, I know it's like a car accident. Like, it's like, ah, uh, I don't want to look, but I have to. I do take a sip of wine after I do that. <laughs> I've been chicken licking for four and a half years. I haven't died, y'all. <laughs> I'm still here. All right, never gotten sick. All right, so I'm going to get rid of that. Oh, no, I'm not because, okay, did I do a tape side up? Oh my gosh. See, I see I messed up too after four and a half years. All right, so I'm gonna do this really quick, watch. I'm gonna go here, I'm gonna do the chicken again, real quick, all right? I'm gonna show you another fun trick I do. All right, so, tag side up. All right, tag side up. You don't have to do a tag side up, but I'm gonna show you, all right. Remove there, okay. Then we test it, it's green, okay. Test it again. <laughs> All right, it's green, right? Not turning purple. Now I wanna show you 
take side up. I'm going to show you Norex microfiber doesn't uh, transfer because I know you're going to be like, okay, Stephanie, what would you do with that cloth next, right? <laughs> Heidi. <laughs> so what would you do with that next? Would you wash it? Yes, you can. I have a bunch of cloths, so I would wash it. But Norex microfiber does clean itself, but it also doesn't transfer. And that's not something Norex can claim, but us consultants like to tell you and like to show you. So I used it. Tag side down. I'm going to put it back on the chicken side. Okay, I'm going to push it down. And I'm going to test it again. Do, 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 do. All right. Still green. So that's showing it didn't transfer. Now the other fun thing I like to show. I like to show it all to make sure, you know, there's no, there's nothing crazy going on. You guys know I want to do that to you. You know, Andrea wouldn't join this awesome company in movement if there was anything, you know, crazy going on, right? <laughs> She's too smart for that. All right, so I want to show you this one does turn purple, so you don't think anything's going on. Like, this one just doesn't stay green, right? So I'm going to take this, and I'm going to stick it in the chicken. All right, Ooh, stick it in the chicken. All right, chicken's turning purple. Okay, so you see that there? So it does turn purple, so... Boom, right? All right, now I'm getting rid of the chicken. All right, testers, adios, chicken, plate. All right, chicken legs. All right, so that is the basics of the Norwex microfiber. So it cleans great, it removes bacteria, but my third and favorite part about Norwex, especially being like a busy mom, or just busy in general, or just don't like to clean and do a lot of laundry. Norex microfiber self purifies, okay? So it rem uh, so as long as removing 99% of bacteria, okay? So that's a whole other area, okay? That's because the fibers are super dense. Now, something else, a whole other third factor, is that those teeny tiny fibers I was talking to you about are laced with microsilver. Okay, if anyone knows anything about microsilver, um, surgeons will use it in their bandages. Um, it prevents bacteria from reproducing. And bacteria needs to reproduce to thrive. And when bacteria can't reproduce, it's like, all right, I'm out of here. So you could use, so Norwex veterans, tell me how long you use your cloths, okay? It depends on if you're home all day, how many kids you have, and all that kind of stuff. <laughs> and how many spills you have. Um, how dirty your partner is or you know whatnot but um i would say i use mine all day every day i would say i go about a week before i wash it and yes you do wash it it's, it's not all crazy magical um but that is because what happens is you have to air dry it okay so there is a little you know now if you put it into like the corner of your sink like this yeah, it's gonna it's gonna smell the next day, okay? Because that silver wasn't activated to work. And micro silver is all safe. It doesn't run out. It doesn't wear out. I posted the EOTech um, award we got for uh, safety. Um, so it's legit. It's really really awesome um, concept to put the silver into those teeny tiny fibers and they're in there like coffee and creamer. They're not going anywhere. I still test my cloth from like seven years ago and it, it still works. It's crazy. So that is what you do. So, um, hanging it, how do you guys hang yours? Um, so you could, as long as there's some airflow, most of the Norwex products have the little hooky, right? So I can, um, I can hang on, you know, the different hooks over the stove, the dishwasher, um, over your faucet. I have hooks in my laundry room. Uh, so you can you can hang it however it, when you go on Pinterest and stuff they have like ways you can hang your Norwex. It's really fun. Um, as long as there's some airflow it will self purify overnight and then you'll be good to go the next day. It will not smell. It's pretty awesome. All right. So do, 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 do. Look at, see after four and a half years I still have post-its. Lick the play. Oh, <laughs> they drop and reminder how to clean the cloths. <laughs> so, all right. Moving on. So that's Envire cloth, window cloth. Talk that to death, but it, it is amazing. And that is how all our microfiber work. Okay, all of it. Um, not just the Envire cloth. And Andrea will go into the other kind of counter cloths and kitchen cloths that we have. Um, so, now I know you're like, Stephanie, don't even talk to me about detergent. I have my detergent that I like. 
you know, I'm not changing, whatnot. And I get that. I was a Purex girl forever. I loved my Purex. <laughs> um, but when I switched over to the Norex detergent, it was like, oh, yeah. So the Norex detergent is saves you money because it's so concentrated. It cleans awesome. And, of course, it's Norwex, so it's healthy. So you have all of these no's that Norwex is not going to put into their detergent. Now, if you use, like, Tide or Gain, um, those are actually the two worst for fillers. And what fillers are um, could be, remember, these companies can kind of put whatever they want into their stuff. So um, antlers, bark, mulch, all of that. We're like, why? Why, Stephanie, why would they do that? So they're trying to create this roughness to clean the clothes, which is really gross. And, of course, it's not good for us, again, going onto our clothes, onto our skin, um, our kiddos' skin, everything like that. Not, not good for us. Um, free and clear detergent, yes, definitely good. Um, our detergent is more cost-effective. And it's free of even more um, items that are, you know, kind of uh, labeled as a toxin. So, and a chemical. So, we we really do have great detergent. I'm going to show you how well it cleans. Don't worry. I would not. Of course, we have to have a detergent that cleans well, too, right? So, and um, going back to cost, very, anything that Norex makes that's not the microfiber, okay? That's a consumable. So, hand wash. Uh, dish soap detergent is made in a way so it's very concentrated and it lasts a long time okay and that's how you're saving money okay so instead of lugging that big thing from Costco or whatnot um you get this little bag it's gonna last you a long time so if you have an he a high efficiency or even a standard this is about how much you need um you don't need the big pore spout and all that crazy stuff going on okay um so with the powder uh, you can get about 100 loads out of, uh, for a HE, and about 66 to 70 for a standard. Don't use a full scoop for a large load, okay? Go lower. That's like a, nor a consultant tip, okay? Save money, okay? So, also, we have a liquid that is really nice. We have both <laughs> because my husband, this is just so easy to do. Um, this is more enzyme-based um, for stains and smells and whatnot. 215 loads for HE and then about 110 standard. So the both of these very good in the um work very well. I like them both. In the safe haven, you can pick which one you want, okay? So the the greatest thing too about the powder though, this is why I have both, is it makes an awesome all-purpose spray. Who uses the all-purpose spray with the detergent? So what you do is take like a tablespoon of the detergent I wing it I'm busy just you know and put it in about 12 ounces of water okay again wing it doesn't have to be exact um, this is something that Norwex doesn't uh, <laughs> you know not condone but doesn't advertise uh, but us consultants we're like we, we got to tell you guys how to do it and it makes the best all-purpose cleaner ever so like the 409 or anything yes a great pre-treat Pam yes it is so, so wonderful. Um, even my husband, he works at Ford, like blue collar kind of worker. Just he's like, where's the UPP? Like <laughs> he uses it to clean his tractor outside um, just for everything. I, it, it just, it cleans anything and everything. It is just a great cleaner. Um, so I'm going to show you here. I have some wine that I put. Um, yes, Magic Potion Heather, Magic Spray, right? <laughs> It's fun. so it's called Ultra Power Plus. So that's why we said it said it UPP. Um, so piece uh, wine on a piece of felt, right? So go ahead, spray. I'm gonna show you. You can see it's kind of like going to town. It's doing its thing. You see that there? My wrist is kind of awkward. Throw it into some water here. And yeah, like Pam said, a great pre-treat. One time after a demo, I had like a white sweater on and I got wine on it. And I'm just like, <laughs> spray it and just get it right out. It's so nice. All right, there we go. <laughs> Heidi, I wasted my wine. I know, right? I always have to have wine open to do this <laughs> the night before. All right, so it got it right out. So you guys can just see how well it works. So it's definitely, um, like I said, most cost effective, healthiest, and cleans great. Like, ah, you can't go wrong with that, right? All right, so moving on, moving on, moving on. All right, cleaning paste. So we did, so safe haven, envirocloth, window cloth, 
uh, detergent, and now we have cleaning paste. Okay, the fourth fourth one here. So, who has cleaning paste? Who loves their cleaning paste? I know a lot of you do. Again, something that was sold out for like six months. You guys remember that? Oh my goodness, it was crazy. We're like, when do we get cleaning paste back? So, like I said, I say paste, but it is it's hard right there. So what you do? So let me, Heidi. This is when I need you to do like a really pretty picture on the tile because this is all I do. <laughs> it's kind of boring. All right, so I have a Sharpie with the word Norwex on my tile. I have been doing this demo for as long as I can remember because I love it so much to show how well cleaning paste works. I've had so many, I could tell you so many stories of what um, uh, cleaning paste has done for me and other people have booked parties just for cleaning paste. I mean, it's just been unbelievable. All right, so put a, a little bit of cleaning paste on in a, any kind of cloth, okay, one of our cloths, and then let that dry, and then just like that, comes right off. Cleaning paste has saved the lives of many children, including my own. <laughs> Sharpie on our new coffee table, Sharpie on the stairs. Um, so, and I'll honestly tell you, I go back, like, if something like that happens, it's like, okay, cleaning paste or UPP, like, you know, some work, you know, for other situations and whatnot. Um, so you pretty much like have your arsenal of, you know, ways to uh, nail polish on my new countertop, which I don't even have nail polish anymore because of Color Street, but my my wonderful, wonderful daughter still found it um, somewhere and uh, was painting her nails. <laughs> oh, there's also a lavender. So because our detergent is so clean and clear it has no scent which I know is kind of weird to get used to but we have a sale on our sandalwood um, orange uh, essential oils or if you can use any essential oils put some essential oils on your dryer balls and then that will give you a scent if you still need you know a little bit of a scent it's a natural scent and not a heavy fragrance scent that's not good for you um, but Norwise did come out with a lavender um, detergent so that is there too for anyone wanting to try that all right so for cleaning paste, I'm going to show you very quickly cleaning a stove top because that is something we mostly all have to do. It's a pain in the butt. I used to just despise it, right? And I want to show you some uh, good tools you can use to do that with. All right, let me get my Enviro cloth here um, without using chemicals and all that kind of good stuff. So first I'm going to use my Enviro cloth and then to scrub it, I'm going to show you I'm going to use a spiri sponge, okay? Who has a spiri sponge? Love the spiri sponges. So, spiri sponges are made to be disposable, okay? But they still last about six months. They come in a two pack, so say you got about a year in there, okay? Anything that Norwex makes that's not a microfiber is designed to not harbor any bacteria, okay? So, this the spiri sponges are woven with a lighter weave so they will not smell as long as you kind of air them out you know do a little air out um then they will not smell and you can put them um in your dishwasher and whatnot as well i think andrea you're going to talk about spiri sponges and i'm just talking about it i'm sorry because i'm so used to talking about them but also okay so these are these are kind of scratchy these are what I use on my stove top. Also, and I, Andrew will touch on those a little bit more. Dishcloths. Love, who has dishcloths? Okay, this is a bad example of a dishcloth. Okay, so this is how dishcloths come, okay? There's two big ones in here. Okay, look at, look how big these are. This is like crazy, like who needs all of that? So it's two, two of them, right? So then you cut it in half, okay? And another consultant trick, and then they last about six months, so you cut the two in half, you have four, two years, right? I'm doing my math right. Two years of dishcloth, so which is really awesome. So these are great. I know they don't look like much, but again, they're designed in a way not to harbor bacteria. You ball these up with some soap, and they will go to town. I mean, doing dishes, I'm going to show you my stove top. Um, they have that mesh, so it doesn't harbor any of that bacteria, right? And smell and be disgusting and all that. So I'm going to show you here. Do, 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 do. All right, look at that. Okay, not terrible. Honestly, I'm surprised. <laughs> so where is my, I mean, seriously, how does my Envirocloth just 
disappear a whole big cloth who knows okay so <laughs> so i'm gonna get all the like crusties and you know whatever cheese and noodles and all that so boom just like that so i'm gonna get all that extra stuff off i'm gonna put it in the sink or the trash can all right so now this is kind of caked on there right egg or whatever that is probably my daughter's milk so Spiri sponge use with the cleaning paste okay nice natural way to clean okay so go like that scratch that off okay you know go up here so a really good way um you know under adult supervision my kids love cleaning the stove top because and it's it's so safe for them so i just love that so much dish cloth love this too i want to show you okay put a little bit in there all right so scrub that out oh yeah that's on there but it comes right off and then do that there all right and then so it's soapy right so now that's when we take our envir cloth and we just oh yeah and of course i'm going super fast for the uh demo so if it's not completely perfect there we go i want it to be perfect <laughs> but time i won't all right so there is cleaning your stove top all right so very very easy what did that take me like 30 no like 60 seconds right so really really good all right so that was so envir cloth um window cloth detergent cleaning paste and now dusting okay so this is the, the fifth and final safe haven um item that's in our safe haven five okay so here's the dust mitt never thought i needed a dust mitt in my life until i tried one of these and what happens it's like a static electricity you could even give it rub it together like this and it kind of is like a vacuum for the dust. If you're using a furniture polish, it's kind of like the definition of insanity because you're spraying, the uh, dust is flying up, and then it's settling back down on something sticky, right? So that's why a dust mitt is so, so good. Um, people will get two of these and kind of like put both on their hands and <laughs> go to town, right? I mean, that's a really fast way to clean. So I'm going to show you, of course, I have to go to the extreme with protein powder to be like my dust right so you see that there all right get all of that see how well this picks up okay look at that so picks up really really well now you're like okay how are you going to clean that so i say you could bang it in the trash can bang it outside free therapy <laughs> take your rubber brush okay love love the rubber brush who has a rubber brush so very, very good quality, very durable, right for cleaning off your dust mitt, for cleaning your mop pads. Also a lot more uses, your stairs, your car mats, um, um, your furniture from pet hair. Um, yeah, Andrea, you have one. There's so many more uses uh, for a rubber brush as well. It's gonna last you a long time. So of course that's protein powder. I didn't get it all the way out, but you can see what I mean by that. So love, love that system. Really